This video is brought to you by BossRootin.com with big sales on now and PowerPerformanceProducts.com where you can receive $10 off your purchase of Body Storm and Body Effects, the best pre-workout supplements on the market. This is Spencer Lazara, MMAinterviews.tv. I'm alongside the king of the cage, 135 pound champion, retained his title tonight, Jared Papazian. How you feeling? Obviously a little bit uh, not happy with your performance tonight? Yeah, not happy with my performance. Uh, I thought I could have finished him. Uh, I didn't. Uh, I didn't really throw my hands. Mm -hmm. I mean, I threw my hands, but I didn't. You know, every time I did throw my hands, I did connect. But I felt like I could have done more with my hands instead of I kept tying them up against the cage. I don't know why. I just got to figure it out. I got the win. I just got to go back to uh, the drawing board and figure out what went wrong. You were obviously worried he was going to come in maybe and take you down. The game plan for him, you figured, was to become him coming in as a wrestler was to take you down. So for you, your wrestling was great. You pressed him against the cage the majority of the fight. You got to at least be happy with that. No, I'm, ha I'm happy with pretty much almost everything except my hands. My uh, submission defense, my wrestling defense, my wrestling, um, putting him against the fence. Everything was on point, but just not my uh, strength, which was my hands. My stand-up is my, 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 my strength, and it was off tonight. Everything else was on, but just my hands were off. How about that guillotine? Was that close at any time? I mean, it, it looked like it was pretty tight, but you stayed calm. Uh, it was pretty close, but I uh, just remember all the stuff that me and Alberto worked on before this, this fight. Uh, little small details I remembered in the fight, and I uh, kept my composure, and, and I, I hang in there, so let him gas his hands and came up back, back on top. Again, the championship rounds kind of like the Abel Cullen fight. You really shine through. One judge had a 50-45, but a lot of the judges had it close, and I'm guessing they had rounds two and three to him, those two judges, and you took four and five after taking round one as well. That's got to bode well for your confidence, knowing in those championship rounds you have that experience going forward. Yeah, uh, those champion rounds are uh, play a huge factor in, in experience-wise. I've done it three times now. Now when I go back to three fives, it's going to be a walk in the park. So next time when I do three fives, uh, um, it's going to be a lot different from doing five fives. I've done five fives pretty much three times in a row. So next time I do three fives, I'll be ready for that. It'll be a high pace. Okay. Anything else you want to say, Jared? I want to thank everybody who came out and supported me. My mom, my dad, my girlfriend, my team. Um, everybody who got me ready for this, for this fight. Gracie Baja and Sino. Um, PKG in Culver City. SK Golden Boys with Ono Domingian. Um, Main event gym. I'm sorry if I don't have everything written down right now to thank you. I just thank everybody who got me ready for this fight. Thank you so much. Okay. Appreciate the time. I'm Spencer Lazar. This man retained his title tonight. Jared Papazian, 135 pound champion here at King of the Cage. Godspeed and party on.